hello youtube this is tana adwar from funnel solution guys welcome to my channel and in this video i'll be teaching you guys how to increase the read speed or maybe the write speed of your sd card so before proceeding with this process make sure you have a rooted device and then i have an application called sd tool installed so before that i'll check my current speed of the sd card i'll get back to you guys when it's done as you could see my read and write speed of the sd card really is 18.6 mbps so open up any web browser i prefer root explorer okay this is a paid app guys so make sure you have installed root browser so after opening root explorer mount the system as read and write this is the most important one guys don't forget to so mount the system as read and write then look for a folder called sys sys so click on that folder this one then look for devices here it is devices click on that then click on virtual virtual folder open that up oh i'm sorry open virtual then scroll down and search for a folder called bbi here it is b e i open this folder and then search for another folder uh, just keep an eye on which folder i am clicking right now that will be named as 179 and 0 yeah click on this one then as you could see there's a file uh, it is named as read underscore ahead underscore kb so guys you need to edit this file this file stores the current speed of my sd card so long press that if you have the explorer please long press that or if you have any other web browser make sure you know how to edit the file in it so long press and open it up in text editor so my sd card speed uh, number is 128 so 2048 and that is 2 mbps and 3 mbps speed gives the best result so i'll change it as 2048 that is 2 mbps speed 2048 and just save it make sure you have a backup of the original file before editing it all because uh, i'm on a custom rom and my the original speed is 2048 i've actually edited it before so do need to worry guys if it is already 2048 then try to change it to 3 mbps if you're not satisfied with your sd card or if your speed is 128 then make sure you edit it to 2048 or something else the number which gives you the best results for me 2048 gives the best results so i'm using 2048 Head back and save the file. Okay, I don't know why it's taking so much time. I'm sorry for such a bad video, guys. I'm really sorry. I guess it's stuck. Shouldn't do so. Okay, it's working. Sorry, guys, I got my phone stuck. And go back, save the file. Yes. and just to see whether changes have been applied or not just open it up again in the text editor and check whether this 2048 or not and another important thing is the changes which you have made now will be reverted when you reboot your device so uh, i mean that when you reboot the device your default speed will be applied to your sd card if you have if you can make sure you edit it again if you want the best results people using virtual ram can Uh, this can be really helpful for them. So, well, let's check whether this thing has actually worked or not.
keep going back um i'll open up lc tools again and i'll start to test my ribbon right speed i'm really sorry guys uh after the results i'll i'll catch you guys after the results but you guys won't be able to see the results properly so i'll post an image if possible at the last so i'll catch you guys after it's done yes guys it's done now yeah I'm sorry for this. I really didn't like. I'm sorry for the for this thing. Okay, this is the read speed. Make sure you pause the video and check out the read speed. And probably the read speed is speed, but the read is higher than the pause. So guys, this is it. This is Tanay Agrawal signing off. Have a nice day. Thank you for watching the video.